This week we continue on learning more prop flare. We've set down the bottle and tin and we're focusing on some other items that we can use in the bar. Uh, this week in particular is going to be uh, glassware. We've got two tumblers or rocks glasses. You can use uh, any ounces, whether the four ounce, six ounce, 10, 12. I think these are probably 14 ounce. Um, you don't want to use pints, um, but this will be great for any kind of uh, low ball glass that you're going to make, any uh, drink like a rum and coke, a vodka Red Bull. Uh, this is a real simple uh, uh, trick that works well for that. Uh, you take two stackable glassware, like so. You probably have them set down in your rail down here. Um, you pick up two of them. Uh, make sure that they're not, uh, if they've been put away wet, make sure that they're not stuck together. You shake and make sure that one on top is, uh, is loose. And the trick looks just like this. There you have. This is really just an extension of the flat behind the back that we learned uh, back, I want to say, in week one. Um, it's really that same throw. Uh, you'll see that I'm taking this and holding on to this one down here. I'm just taking and throwing that one up into a flat behind the back. Like we do anytime when we have more than uh, one item, anytime we have a two item move, start with practicing with just one item. Uh, we, so in this case, we can just take the one here and just practice that real simple flat behind the back. Uh, starting here, keep both eyes on it. You want to go ahead and watch it all the way down. Have your hand down here, kind of at your belt loop, want your thumb kind of on your spine. Go ahead and give it a nice, simple toss, and remember to watch it all the way in. Uh, and so then when you add the second one to it, it's just a matter of making sure it's on the top there, like I said, making sure that it's not stuck to it, making sure that it's nice and loose. And then go ahead, give it a nice, simple toss. Ideally, you want this, uh, the one that's up here, to go ahead and come down so that you're catching it on the bottom. Um, you might have to play around with kind of flicking it with your wrist just a little bit to kind of get it to come to that angle or maybe even pulling towards you a little bit. You really don't want to be grabbing it upside down like this. You want to try and not catch it like that so that your fingers aren't landing in there for sanitary reasons. Also, it's just, it's a lot easier grab if you end up grabbing it in the bottom. So that is some glassware flare that we can do. Uh, practice this one up and next week we're going to have a, a lot more complicated one. So get good on this one and we'll see you next week.